Hi, this is Nick Davis, and this is a tutorial on how to do hair cutouts in Photoshop without relying on paths. I've chosen a picture of this guy here, and if you look at this, it would just be impossible to do any kind of path cutout around here, so we're going to do it by another method. First thing we're going to do, if we look at the layers palette here, what I want to do ultimately is is uh, overlay him onto a blue background so I've got a, a blue layer as a background here. First I'm going to duplicate this layer so I've got three copies and then I'm going to hide the first two. Now this first background layer I'm going to double click over here to the right of the name to get up the layer style palette and down here you'll see two sliders. We're going to select the top one I'm going to just move the image in the background so you can see what it does and move the white slider from right to left and you can see that it removes all the white gradually from the image depending on how far up you go but it's a bit rough so what we're going to do is press the alt or option key and click on the left hand part of this little arrow here and it'll come apart and the transition is much smoother up here so we're going to move that until we're happy with the difference between the blue background and the fur of the hood. Maybe bring up the right hand one as well and go OK. Next we're going to select the middle layer and we're going to go to the blend mode pop-up menu and select multiply. And finally we're going to select this top layer here and we're going to create a layer mask by clicking add layer mask button down at the bottom. And making sure that the layer mask is selected, go select all and delete and then deselect. Next we're going to select um, a brush using the brush tool and we're going to start to fill in the image like so. Now if you go outside you'll see that the white starts to encroach so keep within the image and uh, making sure that the brush it has a feathered edge and not too hard and uh, we're pretty much there. Um, you'll see around the edges there's a bit of a halo effect where the white is uh, starting to encroach on the blue so we're just going to use the burn tool to get rid of that. So we, we can select the burn tool, go back to the layers palette and select the layer part instead of the layer mask part and we select in the options palette, I'll just bring that down, range highlights, take the exposure up to say 100 move that out of the way and uh, burn off the uh, white halo effect around the edge like so. Now if you want to use a path for the harder edged areas like on his shoulders then uh, that's fine but I think that's good enough for the purposes of this tutorial it's just to give you an idea of how to go about cutting out hair without using paths in Photoshop.